I actually got in the, uh, involved with the Midnight Mission through uh, Norm Harris. Norm has been a friend of mine through the guitar business and just a dear friend of mine. Uh, and also Denise Salazar, my assistant, and they asked me if I wanted to get involved and do a show for the Midnight Mission. And I obliged because uh, I was very inspired by the work that the Midnight Mission does and, uh, you know, to be involved in the uh, community. People should get involved in stuff that helps the community in a, in a very immediate kind of geographical basis, you know. If you can help people where you live, the ripple effect goes out from there. The first person that I asked to do a concert for us was Richie Sambora. And I was expecting Richie to say that, you know, I'm very busy, I'm not going to be able to do it. And he said, I'm in, let's do it. And we have since done three concerts and we've raised a lot of money for the Midnight Mission. Richie Sambora was, uh, for years, kind of a go-to guy for Fender for charitable work. I mean, Richie always said yes. I've known him for about 17 years and he never ceases to surprise me and amaze me with the depths of his generosity. There's an old saying in the charity business that it's time, talent, uh, and treasury. Richie's been willing to give of all of those to us, which is very unique. We had a, a young man who came into the store one time, and he was blind, and he was a good guitar player, but he had some disease where he was losing his hearing. And he mentioned that he was a fan of uh, Richie and uh, Bon Jovi, and I said, well, maybe I'll give him a call and see if we can get him on the phone and give him a couple words of encouragement. And uh, when I told uh, Richie about this, he said, uh, do you have this guy at the store right now? And I said, yeah. He said, well, keep him there. I'll be right there. He jumped in his car, came right over. It's just the way you're raised. I think, you know, between my parents and my faith and God, and, you know, I always felt you should give back. And uh, giving is infectious. When you start to give, it does have a ripple effect. And people go, hey, I can do that. You know, it's easy sometimes for those that have the means to merely support a cause, but you know, in Richie's case, it's a lot more than that. He's not only brought his resources to us, but he's brought his talent. Money is wonderful, and everybody should give money, but when people have talent, that is it, and music is uplifting. I mean, the great thing about having the Midnight Mission supported by these artists is not only they're raising all this money, but it's very uplifting. Because I think we all realize that with a twist of fate, any one of us could have been homeless. For me, it's like somebody says to me, hey, look, can you sign this guitar for this charity? It's hard for me to say no. Richie, congratulations, and thank you for all that you have done for the Midnight Mission. It's your golden heart that allows us to honor you tonight here at our Golden Hearts Awards. You know, you have been so giving over the years, and you continue to do that today. And we're honored to share the stage with him, that's for sure. Yes, that's, that's true. So congratulations, Richie. I'd like to congratulate my buddy Richie Sambora for receiving the award. Congratulations to our Richie. We are so proud of you. The whole family and friends, all your back east friends say uh, congratulations. Congratulations on the award, Daddy. I love you so much. Hi, my Richie. Congratulations for the award you will be receiving. I'm very proud of you for this and many, many other wonderful things you do. As always, much, much love and appreciation and thank yous, your mom.